Grace Farms in the River Building, designed by the Pritzker Prize winning architect Sana, has become a new kind of public space, made available free and open to the public six days a week. Grace Farms Foundation aspires to advance good in the world through our peaceful respite and a generative platform to experience nature, encounter the arts, pursue justice, foster community, and explore faith. Our five initiatives are led by experts who have created new outcomes through the porosity of place and cross-sector collaboration. Since opening Grace Farms in October 2015, we've become a local resource and also a catalyst for global systemic change in some of the most pressing humanitarian issues of our time. There are more people enslaved today than at any other time in human history, and it is our moral duty to take action. We are galvanizing domestic and international businesses, governments, non-governmental organizations, and individuals to examine their supply chains, advocate for and draft policies that more effectively combat modern day slavery, become educated and trained to disrupt ties to trafficking, and use their power to build awareness. When it comes to combating contemporary slavery, we have ignited what I know will be a profound force for change in our world. Members of our team have almost 40 years of combined professional experience investigating and prosecuting criminal networks that include as well transnational organized crime syndicates. And despite the scale and reach of these violent networks, there is a lack of funding for training on the job training in the state of Connecticut, as well as at the national level and international level. We provide law enforcement with the training mentorship on live cases and establish a network leading to successful prosecution and convictions. Grace Farms Foundation has the adequate space and setting to allow law enforcement officers and service providers to take a step back, refocus, and learn to be innovative as well as be a step ahead of the criminal syndicates. In addition to working to preserve and explore open space, as well as inspire stewardship of wild lands in the natural world, we're initiating new international collaborations throughout Africa with the goal of protecting endangered wildlife. Today's model of international wildlife conservation is not working effectively, so we are supporting a new model that encourages public-private partnerships between law enforcement and conservation NGOs to combat illegal wildlife trafficking. And our aim is to help lead this paradigm shift. Grace Farms was built to lead certification standards, and that's why we continue to pursue the ongoing lead certification for operations and maintenance. We do this by reducing our electricity and water consumption, the responsible procurement of supplies, restoration of on-site meadows and woodlands, we even do on-site composting, and even growing our own food in our community garden. We hope that our actions will be an inspiration to others to make sustainable choices. Since opening, the Arts Initiative has demonstrated the interdisciplinary potential of Grace Farms, convening collaborators from various sectors alongside artists to consider complex subjects. Our workshop-based approach puts artists and their practice at the center of the research and thinking and produces new site-responsive projects at the intersection of the visual, literary, and performing arts, as well as a range of public programming for all ages. We welcome people of all ages, backgrounds, and interests. We lead community gatherings to enhance civic engagement, and we host government and nonprofit organizations to do their important work, connect with other leaders, and actively participate in our initiatives, which fosters new partnerships and meaningful relationships. At the same time, people can simply come and enjoy the changing of the seasons in a place of great warmth and hospitality. Exploration, contemplation, and dialogue that reaches across ideological and faith perspectives happens naturally in this serene and open setting. We have the confidence that what we're doing here today will forge a new path for the individual and common good, including significant public-private partnerships that will create reverberating change throughout the world.